Hello, this is Brian again from Wright Consulting, and today I'm going to teach you how to defragment your hard drive on a Windows XP based PC. A little bit of background information about fragmentation. Uh, technically speaking, fragmentation is the failure of your operating system to store related data sequentially. Um, this can happen in two different situations. Um, sometimes a file being created is too large to fit into any single available slot on your hard drive, and so it needs to be split into chunks and stored in separate physical locations within that drive. Um, another time fragmentation can occur is uh, when a file is updated and the changes don't fit into the file's previously allotted space on the drive. Uh, what do you do about fragmentation? Well, first you need to know that your drive is fragmented. Um, you can tell that it's getting fragmented because uh, it stops running efficiently um, and sometimes it might not even be able to store larger files because there's no single amount of space big enough to store that file. Um, the solution is to run a defragmentation program and I'm going to show you today how to use the one that comes free on Windows XP. To run the defragmentation program on Windows XP you're going to start by clicking your start button. Uh, go to All Programs, or if uh, you have the classic uh, Start menu set up, you would just click Programs. Um, from the All Programs menu, go up to Accessories, and go to System Tools, and click the Disk Defragmenter icon. Uh, there's also another way to get into this program. Um, if you feel like remembering a command, you can click your Start button and go to Run and type in drfrg.msc and there it is. Uh, there's a couple different things you can do in this program. First you want to select the hard drive that you want to defragment or analyze. Um, then down at the bottom you can see you've got an analyze and a defragment option. If you click analyze it's just going to analyze that hard drive and tell you whether or not you should defragment it. Uh, you can view the report about the drive. It tells you a couple of different things, most important of which is volume fragmentation statistics. Total fragmentation 16 percent, file fragmentation 32 percent, that means 32 percent of the files on my drive are fragmented. Um, if I click close it shows me a uh, little image overview of my drive. The red files are fragmented files, uh, the blue files are uh, those are files that are already defragmented basically. Uh, all of their parts are stored in the same location on the drive. Unmovable files are files that are already running in memory or belong to the operating system and can't be moved. And the rest of the white space up there is just free space on my drive. Um, since it told me I should defragment, right now I would click the defragment button and uh, let it do its job. There it goes. I won't make you watch it, but um, this is performing a defragmentation as we speak. Well, that concludes this video tutorial about defragmenting your hard drive on Windows XP. Uh, please visit my website, www.reich-consulting.net, for more tips, tricks, and tutorials. Thanks again.